hey what's up guys welcome to find gap youtube channel and in today's video i will teach you how you can create this type of profile cards using html and css only in this video we will create this type of profile cards this type of social media icons with a little bit hover effect and friends you can see that this is a complete responsive cards if i will open them on tablet devices the output will look like this and if i will open my output on mobile devices the output will look like this so video is going to be more important and before start i request you to subscribe for our youtube channel for regular videos without any delay let's start so friends first of all you can see that i have a folder named profile cards design and inside this folder i have four profile images and each image have size of 500 by 500 next we have two files the one is index.html and the second is style.css here you can see that i have opened this folder in my visual studio code and to the right side you will able to see the output so first of all i will create a basic html structure and type here profile cards design next i will link the style.css file with my html code next i will create a div with class container type here p element type experts create h1 element and i will type here our team members next create another div with class wrapper inside this create another div with class card create another div with class profile image inside this i will type an image tag and here i will type profile one dot gpg which is the name of my first image next outside this profile image class i will create another div with class content type here h3 profile name p profile designation and in the last i will create another div with class social media inside this i will type here i element and in my project i am going to use font awesome icons to add the font awesome icon search here font awesome cdn click on this first website name cdnjs.com scroll up and click on copy link tag paste this link inside your head section next i will search here font awesome icons click on the first link here i will search for facebook click on your desired icon click on this i element to copy this html code and paste this code here so you can see a facebook icon here similarly i will copy this and paste this three times and type here youtube and instagram next i will copy this complete card class div profile to paste this div here change the image to profile to i will type here name and designation again copy this paste this here profile 3 change the image profile 3.jpg and we have to do these steps for our for our remaining two cards so friends you can see that i have pasted here four divs with class card and to the right side you can see that the output next open the style.css and type here star padding 0 margin 0 and box sizing border box next i am going to use google font in my project so i will search here google fonts click on this first link click on these three bars and select fonts and search for pop-ins click on this font scroll up and click on select regular 400 click view selected families import copy this link and paste this in the first line of your css file next copy this font family property and paste this inside this block of code so these four properties will be implemented on our each html element next copy this body element and paste this element here and type display flex justify content center align item center and background color i will type this color code next copy this container class and paste this class here and next copy this p element and paste here type text align center we are going to design our this experts word margin top 30 pixel right 0 pixel bottom 10 pixel and left 0 pixel color i will type this color code letter spacing 2 pixel and font weight bold next copy this h1 element paste here copy container class and paste here type here text align center margin bottom 40 pixel and font size 2.5 rem you can see the output next i will copy this wrapper class and paste this class here and type here display flex justify content center 
and align item center so you can see that our all cards in a same line i need to open my code editor and output in a big screen next i will copy this card class and paste this class here and type background color white padding top 70 pixel so you can see that top padding is 70 pixel right 50 pixel bottom 0 pixel and left 50 pixel width 25 percent you can see the output and maximum width 350 pixel so you can see the output next type here margin top and bottom 10 pixel and right and left 10 pixel as well so next we have to give the border radius to our card so i will type here border radius 10 pixel so you can see the output next we have to style our this profile image to do this simply copy this profile image class and paste this class here and type width 150 pixel height 150 pixel border radius 50 percent and overflow hidden you can see the output and type margin auto next i will copy this image element and paste this element here and before this copy this class and paste here and type width 100% and height 100% so you can see the output and i have zoom in my screen to 150% next i want to align these title and designation at center so to do this i will simply copy this content class and paste this class here and type text align center you can see the output next i will copy this h3 element paste this element here and before this copy this content class and paste this class here and type font size 1.4 rem margin top 25 pixel and color i will type this color code so you can see that i have choose this color code and here you can see the output next i will copy this p element and paste this element here and before this copy this content class and paste this class here and type color copy this value paste here and change the opacity to 0.7 you can see the output next type here letter spacing one pixel and margin zero so friends you can see the output next we have to design these social media icons so i will simply copy this social media class paste this class here with a dot and type here margin top 30 pixel you can see the output next copy this i element and paste this element here and before this paste this social media class type here font size 1.2 rem color copy this color code and paste here and change the opacity to 0.8 background color you have to copy this your background color code and paste this code here next type padding 15 pixel margin 0 and 3 pixel border top right radius 15 pixel and border top left radius 15 pixel next we have to type here transition 0.7 and this transition will help us when user will hover on these icons so friends here you can see the current output next we have to add the hover effect on our these icons to do this simply copy this element and class and paste here and type here colon hover choose a background color i'm going to type this color code and next type here css color property and copy this color code and paste here and change the opacity to 0.9 so friends you can see the output and uh, the hover effect will look like this next we have to add one more thing cursor pointer so now our cursor will look like this so friends next we have to make our these cards responsive because currently you can see that these cards are not responsive at the moment to make them responsive i will use css media queries type here media maximum width 500 pixel it means that the style that we will write in this block of code will be applied from 0 pixel to 500 pixel so simply i have to copy this wrapper class paste here and type flex wrap wrap and next copy this card class and paste this class here and type here width 100 percent and margin 20 pixel so friends let me show you on mobile devices on mobile devices our cards will look like this next we have to design this for tablet devices to do this simply copy this media query and paste this here above and type here maximum width 969 
pixel remove this margin 20 pixel property and the rest properties will remain same so friends now you can see that it will look like this on tablet devices and our output will look like this on desktop devices i hope you must enjoy this video if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel and share this video with your those friends who want to learn web designing and subscribe for our youtube channel for regular videos and finally thanks for watching